Can you talk a bit about your experience mm -hmm. when Iraq Freedom started? Right. Operation well, Iraq Freedom. Right. So at the time, I was uh, an F-15 uh, squadron commander in England, uh, and we were deeply in uh, the preparations uh, for uh, going into Iraq. If anyone recalls at the time, we were going to uh, invade from the, the south, and then we were also going to invade from the north was the, was the plan. And I was part of the, the portion that was going to come through Turkey from the north. Well, I don't know if any of the other historians in here may remember Turkey, that Turkey, uh, there yeah. was a last-minute vote, and the, the, mm -hmm. the Turks did not support that movement mm -hmm. uh, in, in, from the north uh, in Iraq. So I, all that preparation in my squadron and then did not go in. Um, but I do know uh, uh, that it was such an important time, not just for our service, but obviously for our nation and people here in New York, you know, what, you know, at that time after 9-11, uh, uh, our service changed. I mean, our service changed from that, from that moment. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll, I'll give you one, one probably small example of how we changed. Uh, at that time, we were moving forces into uh, places around the Middle East. And we had a little facility on our base that was about the size of this room where we would prepare units to leave. We'd get stuff packed up. Uh, they would show up to leave, and it was literally about the size of this room. If you go there now, it's about a 20,000 square foot facility mm. that is attached to the parking, aircraft parking ramp that has drive-in for large uh, vehicles because we became an expeditionary air force. And that was really the moment that our service had to change. So explain to me, what does that mean in lay person's terms? It means that as a, as a commander, you have to, your forces that you're preparing and training are about providing those forces out to a joint warfighter. And, and our service changed so that we focused on that so much more from that point on. I really mm -hmm. felt that. So basically your squadron is ready to go at the start of the war, Turkey doesn't allow their airspace to be used. Right. Where, what is, what is going through everybody, the squadrons, mine, commander, etc. at that time? And then where are you guys, re, where are all you servicemen and women repositioned? Well, we all wanted to go. Right. I mean, but where you know, were you repositioned? Did you stay up in yeah, Turkey? Yeah, we stayed. No, we stayed in England. We came, okay. got everybody out from Turkey, and we stayed in England. So you went uh, back. You went back to England. Right. Right. Okay. We went. We went back to England. Mm. Yeah. 